Good afternoon, St. Matthews, and welcome into Noon Prayer. On this Tuesday of the first week of Advent, we're getting close to the end of the year. The calendar year for the secular calendar. Now, we have already reached the end of the Christian calendar and have begun the next year. So, anyway, I wanted to clarify. An order of service for noonday begins on page 103 in your Books of Common Prayer. O oh God, make speed to see, save us. Glory to, to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Now turning the page, let us say Psalm 121 together in unison. I lift up my eyes to the hills from where is my help to come? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot be moved, and he who watches over you will not fall asleep. Behold, he who keeps watch over Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord himself watches over you. The Lord is your shade at your right hand, so that the sun shall not strike you by day nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve you, you from all evil. It is He who shall keep you safe. The Lord shall watch over your going out and your coming in from this time forth forevermore. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Continuing at the top of page 106, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away, behold, the new has come. All this from God, who through Christ reconciled us to himself and gave us the ministry of reconciliation. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us of our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I give to you, my own peace I leave with you. Regard not our sins, but the faith of your church, and give to us the peace and unity of that heavenly city, where with the Father and the Holy Spirit you live and reign, now and forever. Amen. I invite your prayer requests, your intercessions, your petitions, your thanksgivings. I ask your prayers for all of those who are on our prayer list. I ask your prayers for Camp McDowell. I ask your prayers for Joe, our president, Kamala, our vice president, for Kay, our governor, and Paul, our mayor. We pray for Michael, our presiding bishop, for Glenda, our diocesan bishop, Father Sam and Father Steve, we ask your prayers for Lynn, our deacon, and Karen, our postulant for holy orders. We pray for the Blancos, the Blizzards, or I should say Dennis Blizzard, Bill Stewart, the Bogards, the Boyds, the Brockines. Okay, St. Matthews, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for Wednesday Eucharist. Until then, let us bless the Lord. Amen.